ever have someone in your life where they clearly have abused you, they have physically hurt you or damaged you or your property or emotionally slandered you or stolen from you in front of your eyes, but don't take accountability? Not only do they not take accountability, they continue the abuse and they act as if they're the victim. Well, if you're scratching your head or if you're in deep despair wondering why people can be so evil, cruel, vindictive, revengeful, well, stop scratching your head. The answer is very simple. This is not about you. This is not about you in any personal way, although you should protect yourself. Call a friend, stay at your mom's house, call a lawyer, call the police. Do not passively ignore the abuse. Love yourself enough to protect yourself. However, don't think this is about you. This is not even about how they feel about you. This is about one thing only, how they feel about themselves. People who are cut off from their heart cause wreckage to those in the external world because they do not connect to their own feelings. So do not understand other people's pain because this is what was done to them. This is a repetition of what was done to them. So if you are the victim, you take it very personally. You think it's about you. And because you also somewhere are not healed and because you yourself are not tapped into your own self love, you may then interject that. You may then internalize that and say, it's all about me. And then that person's abuse becomes your self definition. So this is a lesson for you to understand that what they are doing to you, saying to you is a reflection of them and how you internalize it, whether you take it in or you dismiss it is a reflection on you. People who are not empathic, who cannot touch their heart, who cause wreckage to others' hearts, who cause pain and abuse, especially to our children and don't take accountability are humans who were once children who perceived the same emotional sledgehammer to their own feelings. But it's not your job to fix them. It's not your job to be their therapist or their mothers or their early caregivers because you never can. Your job is to love yourself, protect yourself, stand up in your worth, love them from far. Understand it's not about you. It is all and only all ways about them.